At Drenham we've produced a four to six aqua bungee, which is perfect for skimmers like these and F1s. With the new aqua bungee, there's a Dacron connector comes with it. And in this short video, I just want to show you how to connect the Dacron connector onto the end of the elastic. It's a very, very simple task. Inside the actual packet is an explanation leaflet of how to fit the Dacron connector. But I'll just show you how simple it actually is. Just put that to one side. Right, once you've took the aqua elastic out of the packet, this four to six size bungee, just wet it with some saliva to knot it. Always wet elastic when you're knotting it because if you don't, it grips itself and will tear the elastic. Even when I'm pulling it tight, it's nice just to keep it well moist so that the knot can be tightened right down. You must tighten this knot down, otherwise it will slip. So once it's tightened in place, then it's a simple task of pick up the Dacron connector. This is the smallest Dacron connector we do, and you can already see that there's a loop formed at the base of it. When these Dacron connectors come um, on their own, they're actually around a piece of all a plastic. So that's formed a loop in it, like it is there. And then it's simply a case of just passing it over the end of the elastic. And then as it arrives behind the knot, just pull it tight behind the knot. Using your fingers, you can tighten that knot right down behind the knot that you formed on the actual aqua elastic. And once that's in place, I just like to adjust it so it's right at the back of the knot. It needs to be tight up to that knot. You can already see it's impossible now to pull the Dacron off from behind that knot already. But once the rubber olive is pulled down over the elastic, then it's trapped in place as well. It's just impossible. I can pull that as much as I want. I'd break the elastic before I can actually pull that Dacron connector off. Now the Dacron's got a knot at the end for you to attach the rig to, but you must trim off the piece of elastic behind. Now when you do this, take a pair of scissors, but be careful not to cut the elastic that you're cutting it up against. Just cut it off nice and neat behind. So that's your Dacron connector in place. Very, very simple. Now to actually connect the rig on, once you've got the Dacron in place, I'll just show you, I've got a, another top here that's been made up. It's got the, the yellow size bungee in with a, a slightly bigger yellow connector to it. And I'll just show you how to connect to that. This is just one of one of my shallow rigs that I'm just going to connect to it. Now what I do, I just have a, a simple, I use a, a loop tyre and I have a three turned long knot, which is very, very strong with just a single loop on. Now I prefer this because I know that that knot is very, very strong and won't let me down. And all I do then, I pass the main line of the rig through that loop and then attach it behind the knot on the Dacron. Now again, just wet it, pull the loop through and then pull it tight, but pull it tight once it's at back of the actual knot. Now you can see you've got a very, very simple way of attaching then. Because the Dacron stuck out from the pole, when you were splashing a rig and fishing shallow, very, very difficult to get the line taffled behind the actual connector. This is why these connectors are so good. They're very, very neat. They fit up against the PTFE bush. And of course the Dacron, because it's stiff, keeps the actual line away from the end of the pole. To take the rig off, all I do is just shove this line. I mean, most, most of my carp rigs are on 016 up to 023 in diameter line. So you can shove off the actual knot. So you can remove the rig from the end of the pole with no trouble at all. There is another way that you can actually do it. You can actually tie, I've just tied a knot 
what they call a double knot. I've got a double overhand figure of eight knot at the end and then a loop of line and another figure of eight knot here. And just by placing the main line then through the centre, through the middle loop, then you can connect again onto the, the actual Dacron. Now by using a double knot like this, once you've been fishing for a while and you want to pack up, it's a simple task of just pulling that loop and you can remove the actual full rig with no problems at all from the Dacron. So that's as aqua bungee and connector and an easy way to remove your rigs from the actual connector.